Hello, everybody. And I guess Gauntz here, also known as Titan Creations, and today we're back in Okami. For last time, we did the second Devil Gate Trial. And now, there's only one Devil Gate Trial left. And, two stray beads left. Look at that. That is beautiful right there. That is beautiful, is it not? Two stray beads left. Let's get right to it. The last Devil Gate Trial is right here out. Oh, there, son. Right here outside of of Webcure. Man, these trials really put you through it. Even like sped up, it's like it's gonna be a lot of time. He's in the all the way in the back here. The last Devil Gate Trial. See if we can handle it. See how much I won't waste time babbling and said, Yes, return you to the good music. What? Huh? Wait a minute, what? Wait, why is it not here? Huh? Wait, where is it? I did the other two trials. You saw my stray beads. Where, where is. What was going on? Ch check the wiki. According to the wiki, it's supposed to be here. Okay, what if I leave and come back in? No. Why isn't it here? It's supposed to be here. I did the other two trials. Do I need to reload the game? Hold on. But why is it not here? What? Excuse me. Why the heck is the Devil Gate not here? It's supposed to be here. Do I need to reload the whole entire game? Like reboot the game? Why isn't it here? Hold on. Look this up. Oh, this one doesn't spawn until you you beat the, beat the boss of the chapter. Oh, okay then. I guess I guess we can't get this one now. We have to beat the boss first. Okay then. Well, it looks like we have to resume the story in order to progress here. Yeah, so I guess that one this doesn't spawn until you beat the area boss. So we gotta do that first. So we're back to the story. Hey Shira, hey Oki. Hope nothing happened while I was gone. We guys gotta advance the story now. Oh, I, back when we were at the blizzard machine, where we freed Itagami, there was another path I saw. Like, do you go to that from here, I wonder? I almost feel like I missed something. Here we go. I start it starts like here after how many how long it's been. There we go. That was weird. She knew he wonders and farther away than Oki does. <laughs> Don't you worry about this wolf. I'll catch up with you once I finish off the rest of the monsters and make sure that they're saving before you get to the that air nurse he got to your divine power. Look, it won't do any good sitting here worrying about Shiro Nui. We owe this other we owe this other furball here a big time. Let's go finish off those smart demons. I just got, we just gotta continue onwards now. You don't got a choice. Shame, I was all oiled up to do the third Demon Gate trial too. I don't even know what it entails. Alright then, let's assume we're going into the other tower now. Oh, okay, this is the other area I saw from the Blizzard Machine. So we haven't missed anything. Let's go to the barrier block in the door back there. Do we use this? Break those cans over there. Okay, they, they sit. They turn 90 degrees before they fire. Okay, gotcha. Let's do this and gotcha. All right. Okay. No one needs to fire backwards for a secret. I don't see anything. 
That guy's trying to hide behind a tree. He thinks he's sneaky, but he's not. Gotcha! Boosh. Alright. This is weird. I think this is two, there are two more cannons on the opposite side. The, like horizontal to vertical positioning here kind of looks weird. Can they actually shoot you? Hold on, if I step forward. Oh, there's a nice pit. It's probably you try to cross the pit, they all demolish you. But it's saying no, you, you can just do this to make it easy on yourself. I guess if you want hard mode. Oh. Oh, there's another cannon up there. Couldn't even see. I guess, I guess you just reduce, down, reduce it down to the one cannon. I suppose if you want to do a hard mode, you leave the other four intact before you try to cross the pit. Nope. What do you think you're doing? Nope. Nope. Did I kill it at least? No. There's a gap there between the third and fourth platforms. Get out of here. What? What do you mean? Are you joking, kidding me? I'm gonna see him not none of those hit that guy, because I fell down the pit both times. No! Hit him! There we go. Okay, as soon as I hit I only hit the ice pillar each time. That's what the thud noise was. Alright, well, camera turned around, that was weird. It's clover out in the open. Come on! Seriously, stop doing that. You stop being a joker. Look at ice physics. Come on, come on. Let's get serious already. Here we go. You see the other area? Yeah. You can see it over there, that's where we were before, on the way to the Utagami snow machine. Right, so I know there are no more loose stray beads about, it's all just treasures, it's when you're high. Hello there. How about you? I guess I can now read up on your finisher. So you are the great Tengu, your finisher is Blizzard. Okay, gotcha. There's an ice pillar right next to us. Big news. Okay, yeah, because you're breathing fire. So that checks out. Yeah, you know, ice face is the end. Now I know all your finishers. Now you all are done for. In the future playthroughs, I can use information to my advantage. 285 demon fangs. Almost 300. You know, I could just go back to Kiba, back in Aka the Forest, and just humor him. Give him some more demon fangs as a souvenir. Hello there. Oh, these are flaming hot. Even your sullies down, they'll burn you. Is there a key in here? Is there a platform I can't see? Oh, it's over there. So what if I rain? That does not put them out. I gotta use ice. Is there an ice source in this room where you're required to use Blizz Storm? I don't see an ice source in this room. You just have to use Blizz Storm. No, it doesn't work on you. Uh, power Slash? No. What? Can I drag ice from outside? That's too far away. That doesn't cool them down. Uh. Excuse me? Am I missing something here? That. Because that's just going to hurt me. Yeah, what? Huh? Beg your pardon? Uh. Wait. Oh, wait. 
Can I? Is there a snowball here I can bring inside? Maybe that's a thing. Though so there's ice here. That's not what to do. Oh, I can't breathe through the middle ice. Uh huh. Go ahead. Pardon? What do you want me to do here? I guess it seems like it could be important. I'm not sure how to use it. I was going to Hunter Blossom, Durr. Where's that? It's your ball return. Are there more of them? I only see the one. What am I supposed to do here? I don't have an ice weapon. That's the one element I don't have. I don't think it's ice. I think I had to buy that, anyways. What am I supposed to do here? Is there something outside I'm supposed to bring in? Do I melt this with my fire? Oh, okay, that's it. So it was like the ice ball we saw at the scale puzzle earlier in the dungeon. No. That's what it was. Nope. Okay, I forgot. The thing you do with ice is that you melt it. To focus on all the other things recently. There we go, that's all we needed. This is a solution to our problems right here. Use this. And. Chibonk. All nice and frozen up. Now, what do you got? Let's see, emerald tassels. You, for you, just kindly shut up. As, as, that's why I said, shut up. Cease yourself. And oh, that's a cherry bomb crack. I thought it was just a key sitting out in the open. Now it's a key sitting out in the open. Sure is good when you reach the ice ball from all the way over here. I missed, I missed some of the wheels. But it's not a problem. There we go. I might, I might cut out or speed up some of that room. I was bumbling around for a while. Not sure what to do. Okay then. Now we're in the second tower. And there's an imp merchant. Hello there. Is someone going to stop me from talking to you? Nope. Now Oki's here. How did you get here before me? I guess maybe you, you, you get confused by that room. Who goes there? Hey, how'd you get in here? You ain't come to invade us poor folk of Waku Shine, alright, have you? If you have, you got me to answer to. A fight to end all fights. Best of me settled it. You better bit us, of course. I suppose this guy moved here from Oni Island when he saw it was crumpling. Well, I already did my shopping off screen. I do this myself. I can sell the emerald houses I just got. Do I want anything? No, not really. Right. So, what free goodies do we have in stock here? <clears throat> Got good tiny pottery. Looks like a gaudy charm. Okay, a free goodie and a little bit of money. It's to pad your pockets. This is, a, this is like a battle. I put my life in the line for it. I don't care who I have to take on. I ain't planning on giving them anything away. You don't have to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you just tiny pottery. You give me your money in exchange. All right. What happens if I freeze ya? <laughs> oh, he turns into a snowman. Oh, that's what that the information in school was about. And that, that's funny. All right. Save here. Aku shine deep. What if I? Do very particularly. Yeah, 
Yeah, that also freezes him. That's funny. Alright. No, it's on the Oki steam. Alright, there's no water here. You need to start with a clock. If you look up. Yeah, there's, I, think, I don't think there's as much preamble in this tower as there was in the other one. Hey, man. How'd you get here so quickly? Oki! How'd you get here so quick? Yeah, exactly. Actually, I owe to that wolf and his little friend. A punk will appear after you left and told me to go help Amaterasu. So that was the wolf's companion you were talking about, right? That wolf really seemed to perk up when that punk will appeared. It looked like the wolf had recovered somewhat. I sensed they had a bond. A bond that made me feel they'd be okay. So I left them and came rushing here. In any other game, this might be a trick. I don't think it is here. We're enough talk for now. I take it that if, if you're here, those demons must be somewhere up ahead. Well, Amaterasu, will you fight alongside me? That's Rumble. Oh, spirits of the air, earth, and sea, grant us your divine power. On to the fight we go. Last time it was just a silver demon Nechku, but now... This is where those bird brains went. They're trying to hide while they lick their wounds. We can't let these infernal contraptions get away with this get away this time. I don't think we have enough energy to chase them down again. I mean, where else would they go? The Orochi's lair? Them? Get away again? <laughs> no prey has ever eluded my trusty Denkamaro more than once. No, my own. Swordsman's for life. Katona glows silver. It's Wolf Duo time. Two versus two. I should probably change my equipment. Wait, hold on. I don't need the water tablet. Here, let's turn this on. So. Yeah, okay, that seems good. Yeah, yeah, alright. So I have absolutely no idea how this goes. Can you stun them with thunder? Not right now. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Get out of here. Knock it off with that. Okay, can I shock you? So, there's one of those trees in the background. Egg. Okay. Machiku tried to hatch an egg. I don't know anything about this boss fight. Bloom. Yes, they, they do they do things in your spawn. There's nine tails of sword. Oh. Oh hi. Now I'm Matarasu. Pull me back like an arrow and fire me at those demons. I will pull them down to the ground. Okay, that's a mechanic. Well, that's a thing. Alright then. That's a little weird, but okay. Let's go get the first lickens. I guess it's just a chain of they do things and you respond accordingly. That is a bomb, so you ignite it. Hi. Nope. Oh. Nashku uh, is already stunned. Okay, weird. So I, I electrify them, I meant to power slash. And it's kind of like a puzzle of, do you know your abilities? That's what this boss fight is. The, these things are just like, do you remember power slash? Okay. What's next? Oh, you're both doing things at the same time. Thunder and Bloom. Okay. 
here we go. Let's go for Lechku. Come here, you. Which time is Power Slash 3 do? A lot. Power Slash C Rex. I like her mechanical legs, that's cool. Okay, why is the camera focusing on just him? I want to be able to see both of them. Oh, because he's, he's swooshing at us. Hoot. Nope, where's the fire? Oh, the fire is on my back. Cursor, thank you. Come on, Nushku, you're getting it. Can't get it in time. You're both about to get it. Get, get your wickets in. They're both on the ropes. This was it's, it's very. This was an interesting boss fight. It's very gimmicky. Another power slash reminder. Ashku just has a separate one. Ashku, you're going first, boy. Get out of here. It's done for. Dead Dolly. Bloomy. It gives you healing, it's kind of weird. Bomb. Bombs? You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as you get your ass kicked. Goodbye! Okay, that was kind of weird. It wasn't that long, but it was interesting. I will die with my brother. A kamikaze death. Make sure they die at the same time. And that's it. We save the mountain from the clockwork demons. The twin demons, which had suddenly awoken atop Ezofuji and tried to lay waste to the land of Kamui, were defeated. They disappeared in the burst of petals thanks to Oki and the Matarasu. However, a giant cloud. Black as night, cast a shadow on the scene. Blight, Nine Tails, the twin demons Lechku and Nechku. The souls of each were swept into the cloud as it moved. It drifted toward the Ark of Yamato at the bottom of Laoji Lake. The Ark of Yamato was beckoning all of the world's darkness within. Tusco's words echoed, echoed ominously, awakening Amaterasu's heart. All the sacrifices, all the life lost in the name of good. Was it all in vain? Shiranui, Amaterasu's a hundred year old incarnation, was fatigued and exhausted by the intense battle. His face looks so sad, he's bleeding. Really feel bad. So you see, each character has a little inscription over their head, including Ishaku, who is green for some reason. <laughs> However, when Shirinui noticed the glow of Oki's sword, Kotone, a sly smile seemed to crease the wolf's tired lips. Satisfied with this bright glimmer of hope, Shirinui struggled to rise and put every last ounce of strength into passing through. Ishaku's gate back into time, back home. As I surmise it's Konohana, the original guardian sapling of Sakya in the, in, through the portal there. It's fully grown, curiously enough, which is weird, because it wasn't when we were back there a hundred years ago. I suppose it's more recognizable, though, is why they did that. As Amaterasu and Isu looked on, they were fully aware that Shirinui headed back into the face of danger, to the battle with Orochi, after saving Nagi from the clutches of death and aiding them in their own quest, she knew he would die a hero, marking the beginning of the legend of Orochi. So Shirinui helping us here in the present happens before they went to rescue Nagi at the end of the Orochi battle in the past. There's a weird Bushed up paradox things. How did Shiru knew he knew to be here a hundred years in the future? He came forward in time of his own volition to help his future incarnation. That's a little confusing. 
Like, how do you know? As Ishaku left the scene, his eyes betrayed a sort of toughness one exhibits when preparing for a grave event. He knows what's coming. He knows it's inevitable. He usually watches on. And from Machiko and Nashiko's cadaver, we get a sun fragment. Okay, very Zelda of you. You obtained sun fragment. You collected three sun fragments to form a unit of solar energy. We completely filled our health. There is no final weapon from a boss, I think. A little off in damage, but you can in time. It's a very gimmicky boss fight. Achievement unlocked. Twin bird brains. Defeat the twin demons, Nachku and Nachku. Like to save the game? Of course. Now, at this point, I would recommend. If we're just, we're good, well, I'm not going to recommend yet. For personal, for personal reasons, I'm going to save this in slot 2. First time using one of the other slots here. You don't need to do this, but I do this for sentimental reasons. And now. Amaterasu and the others return to the foot of Ezel Fuji. There they saw Lika praying intently. The storm had subsided. Then, as if to celebrate their hard-won victory, the twin volcanoes of Ezelfuji erupted in great pillars of flame. The villagers felt the warmth on their skin and wept tears of joy. However, Oke merely surveyed the scene stoically, remaining silent. Although the evil demons had been driven away, the thought of having taken the sword and caused so much grief weighed heavily on his heart. The only one who could ease the burden of his woes was Samical. The chieftain who had rescued Kemu from the shrine stepped forward. Suddenly he approached Oki, offering an outstretched hand. It's like the it's like that one meme of the two buff arms shaking shaking hands. What was that from? Die Hard? I don't remember. His eyes betrayed the complexity of the emotions behind the gesture. Oki, realizing the gravity of the scene, extended his hand in turn. The moment they shook hands, Webkir was reborn into a village far too strong to ever fall victim to evil again. As for Kotone, the sword that vanquished the twin demons, he was returned to his pedestal by Oki's own hands. And as long as the glow remained, no evil dared draw close. Katoni's gleam spoke of a power too great to succumb to evil. At that moment, a brilliant flash of light shot forth from Katoni, striking squarely on the frozen surface of Lauchi Lake. Though the lake had never shown any sign of melting, Cracks began to open up along its surface. The legend of the Iron Ark, Yamato, said to have fallen from heaven, and the holy Lauchi Lake which it called it home was revealed to be more than a mere legend before all those present. Rises. The door opens. And then, strangely enough, our rainbow bridge forms. Sword. The Ark of Yamato, 
They say it fell from the heavens. It is indeed imposing. The wall of ice still shattered and opened the way to the heavens when Kotone shows glowed silver. The prophecy's wall of ice is not the demon's blizzard. Rather, it is the ice on our perpetually frozen lake. Yamatarasu, if that ark is the way to the heavens, then you must embark upon it. That we have not known each other long. I can already tell what sort of being you are. And for you, the realm of the gods lies ahead. It is a journey the rest of us cannot take. You knew that, didn't you, Amaterasu? Legend says the Ark of Yamato is the root of all evil in our world. To think we could suffer such an to think we would suffer such a misfortune after the demons were defeated and warmth returned to Kamui. So this right here, the Ark of Yamato. Oh, the sky, the sky is glowing. It's like an aurora, or ominous aura. Aurora or ominous aura. Tusco, I'm scared. I want to talk to Tusco. The, the, the Ark of Yamato. It's floating in the sky. Tusco, I'm scared. I'm trying to talk to Tusco. How can such an enormous thing float into the sky like that? It must mean what the gold legend says is true. The legend of how, about how this ark, which was sunk in Lao Chi Lake, fell from the celestial plane and into our world. It says the celestials who fell to our world with it were eaten up by countless vicious monsters. By the army controlled by the evil ruler of darkness, Yami. So the Ark of Yamato is related to the powers of darkness. Can't examine the sword. So this, this right here, is the final point of no return in the game. Once you cross that bridge, there's no going back. Next time on Okami, we're not crossing the bridge because we've got some unfinished business back down in the land below. Also, dog. Nope, it's getting too close to her. She cute. <laughs> Look at her. He's adorable. He's like the other kid. She's absolutely adorable. She's a small pupper. <laughs> Let's see the little pigtails. Hey, what? Hey, why is Eastern still glowing? Outside of battle. That's weird. So next time, we go do our unfinished business. So until then, my name is Zachary Zagos, also known as Dutchman Creations, and I will see you then. Thanks for watching.